Crops for Better Soil What is it? Crops for Better Soil seeks to demonstrate that ecological agricultural practices on rain-fed land can increase soil fertility and crop yields while avoiding the use of chemical fertilizers, pesticides and genetically modified organisms. Main Objective The main objective is to offer a viable, irrigation-free solution in areas with a poor soil in order to stop land degradation due to erosive agricultural practices or land abandonment. Specific Objectives Improve soil quality Reintroduce at least five traditional crops Improve the common perception of organic agriculture and farmers' quality of life Demonstrate the economic viability of organic agricultural production in semi-arid lands. What is the methodology? We seek to evaluate the effects of organic agriculture as compared to traditional practices for different rain-fed crops. The project was undertaken across a total area of approximately 400 hectares, located in four Spanish autonomous regions, Castilla-La Mancha, Castilla y León, Aragón and Navarra, over five years. Each year, a special training program was given to the participating farmers. Organic production in extensive crops on rain-fed land in semi-arid climates, weed control, soil management and fertility, rain-fed extensive crops management and crop rotation, soil microorganisms and biofertilization, edaphic and geophysical soil analysis, plantation and fertilization program, soil preparation, fertilization, sowing, weed control and harvest, monitoring and technical control systems, final technical evaluation. Conclusions The most important parameter is the increase in soil biology. We optimized crop management with a minimal production cost. We introduced new traditional crops. We received a positive response from participating farmers and obtained higher profits for farmers. Organic agriculture helps maintain Mediterranean agro-systems in line with the objectives set out in CAP and greening policies. Crops for Better Soil Project co-financed by the European Union through the LIFE programme.